feel that we met in Grand Central for a reason. We were meant to find each other. Sure you're okay? My purse was stolen. I got like 80 bucks. How far are you going? You can't help me. So what do you want to do? You want to get a hotel room or something? Excuse me? No, not, not. <laughs> Jesus. Not for us, for you. If we can find your purse, we can get you home and make me a hero. You want to come with me, have a little adventure? I'm sure that my husband will really appreciate your helping me. I think you might be missing some hardware. What is that supposed to mean? You're not wearing a wedding ring. No, I'm calling it like I see it. Oh! Go back to whatever you were doing before I came along and I ruined your night. You didn't ruin my night. I like your uh, shiny trumpet. You bought it with a shiny engagement ring. What we need is a time machine. Well, let's try. What would you tell yourself? Just skip New York altogether. But then you wouldn't have met me. I still haven't decided if that's a good thing. Have you ever had a feeling that somebody was going to play a major part in your life? Yeah. It's possible that you could meet somebody who's perfect for you, even though you're committed to somebody else. We love what we love. It sucks. How can one of the worst nights in my life also be one of the best? Do you know the most interesting thing about Hotel Heart? It's what's on the back. Gotta go, the hookers are here. We probably shouldn't touch anything in this room. <laughs>